how do you stop uh, loading that default HDRI in there? You can set up a different HDRI in render settings like what I have, right? And imagine I didn't have a character in here. I could just go and uh, delete my character out. I won't do it now, but uh, you, you know what I mean. You just you just take out everything, set up your render settings as the defaults that you'd like. In fact, set up a scene that you like to have as a default. Like what I do is I don't like the default settings for the filament draw options because they're too blown out. So what I do is I create myself a filament draw options node and then I select it in the scene and under parameters, I go and dim this down so that it's more something that looks closer to my IRA preview. I mean, it's not it's not there 100 percent. I need to set this up properly. There's also the scene lights that you can film it if, if you had scene lights. We don't. But if we had so, you know, the default, I think, is like this, which is unusable for me. So I go and turn this down to something that's, you know, more to my liking. And once I have that, and you can do the same for the render settings, pick the HDRR that you like, and then go and save this all as a scene. Save it in a safe place that you know where it is, like maybe a Dropbox folder or something. Don't save it on your desktop. Do, do it properly. Don't be like me. Save it properly. Once you save that, you can go over here to Edit Preferences. And then you can define that as a default scene when you open DAS Studio or when you create a new scene. So you head over here to Startup, I think. And then you have this option here on launch, load a file. So you just go and browse to that file that you've saved with a new HDRI in, and then you define that here. So that means every time you launch DAS Studio, this file is going to be there. Very important. There's another option closely related to that, and that's in scene here. You've got a similar dialog here, which means load a file when you create a new scene. And if you wanted that to be cohesive, no matter if you start that studio or if you want to create a new scene, you can define the same file and then your personal preference HDRI and whatever other settings that you have, maybe default camera, maybe default lighting set, maybe a default character even in the scene could be loaded the moment you launch DAS Studio. So that'll save you a couple of clicks.